he's oh wait he's flashing the flash anyways so welcome back to a brand new video as you saw in the last clip um in the first clip basically we went to the atrium and we bought some homeware stuff for a house that we don't have which is absolutely bloody great and now we decided that we're coming to valletta to have lunch because someone is absolutely starving you haven't been on the channel for a while you want to say hi 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 so yes, so let's go and eat. we just ate and now we're just leaving the parking right now we did one thing which was going to a photo booth and I thought they were going to be black and white they colored a bit a bit sad about that but now we'll show it to you later because I have to leave bye so I'm gonna push you a tiny bit back so do you see me I hope you can see me well no um, so basically um, we went to the atrium as I told you and I will be showing you the items that we got for a house that we don't officially have. Isn't that bloody great? So let me show you the first thing we're gonna tackle is the what's it, what's it called the kitchen. So for the kitchen I've been eyeing, I needed, I was searching high and low for bloody sugar tea and coffee containers didn't find what i wanted but i found these which which can work for now so basically they're these just this is the tea this is the sugar and this is the coffee one Basically, they were 9 90 each. If maybe you would like to search them on the atrium site. I don't know if... Can you see it? Yes. There, you may find them. And yes, and I thought they would be really, really cute. Sat next to each other. Like so. Let's see. Can I manage? I don't think I can, but let's see if I can show you better. Like this. So yes, maybe I will get them like personalized and stuff i don't know yet but to make them a bit more me but for now they can they will do then and to be honest a lot of things that we really needed for example like tea co tea sugar coffee container they were like over like 30 40 euros i was like are you bloody joking like i know we paid nearly like 30 euros for these because like 13 euros each nearly but like 40 50 euros for such a can like are you joking anyways so we ended up buying these three because we know we can use them and we don't we won't get bored of them hopefully then we got this yellow fruit basket for our like centerpiece for the table our we don't even have a table so hey ho this was 1990 so we want to check that can we check it can you can you actually see mister oh 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 don't think you can actually see that well wait a second i'm just gonna go as close as possible and just focus on you here you go but focus so yes we bought this and apparently apparently my boyfriend told me that he hardly eats fruit so that was a bloody waste of time space hopefully we use it i don't know then moving on to cutleries same thing goes to the cutlery section the cutlery section was horrendous like we were talking about 50 70 euros for like a set of six like for like six people so we're like talking 24 pieces and it's like ridiculous mate it's like literally literally ridiculous so first we're going to go for something that wasn't like a set and then we said no because it's gonna cost us even more so we decided to go for the single ones which are like these 
So we got the spoons, we got two sets of spoons, there are three in each. Two sets of forks, three in each. Knives, there is, um, we need another three set, another two sets because there are two each. And a set of six um, teaspoons. These basically are a bit, um, I don't know if you will find them on the site or not, but basically if you take them all together, it doesn't cost more than 30 euros. So if you're looking for a six, uh, uh, cutleries for six people, can you actually see it? Just look for these. I'm just showing you the barcode. So if you need anything, you just check them out. Can we see it? Okay, I don't think you can actually see what I'm, I'm showing you, but maybe it is a bit more helpful. These are the forks. And these are the spoons. Can you actually focus? Focus, focus, focus. Olay. So that was all the cutlery. And then, because those were like the knives that we got, these ones, are like butter knives. So we decided to get like proper meat knives for six people. And we got these for 15, 70 cents. And they look sharp, they look good for the meat. So if you're interested, go and grab these. This is the article number. Can you see it? Don't think you can, can you manage? So yes, that's the article number. And then my boyfriend decided to get this as well, like more knives basically, um, to chop, I think, bread and meat and a bit of everything. And uh, he paid, instead of 37 euros, 29.60 for it. So yet again, if you need the code, it's here. It's, they're so small, the codes. Anyways, um, and then going for the be the bathroom, uh, we decided to go for this this one over here, which is like a black bin. It's three liters and it's sixteen twenty. So just a basic um, um, bin. Then we decided to go for the set or for the bathroom, which is the green set, like glass but green. This is the the soap dispenser. It's $5.99 and obviously this is the code if you're interested in can you manage whoop whoop no I don't think you can manage to look at it can you can you can you can you Oy. so that's that and this is for the toilet brush and this was $14.99 and this is the code wait I'm gonna do this and this is the code can you see it can we actually zoom in Yay ho, here you go. So yes, we got those. And as well, last time, because like a few weeks ago, we got um, two or a couple of pieces. I'm gonna grab them, just a second. I'm gonna show them to you as well. So yes, we got a few things, a few, just a few. All right, so we got, let me show them. Let me show them to you. Just, I'm gonna move a bit more to this side. Can you see me a bit better? So yes, so we bought this this one again for another bathroom, like a soap dispenser. I know I don't remember the prices, but it's this one, it's a gold finish, and this is the code. This is all from Atrium, so if you need anything. No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. These are from Homemade, actually. This is from Homemade. But I saw even Atrium has those, so if you're interested, we can grab those or we bought these from the atrium i think these i got from the atrium i'm not sure homemade or atrium they're from the same company so hey ho then i we bought the toilet brush to match it same finish and with the toilet brush and this is its code if you need it oops see daisy let's see can you can you focus on it can you focus so yes, that's the code. Then we also bought. Um, let me show you the 
Okay, so my boyfriend really wanted for our future house to have the electronic um, salt and pepper set. But they were super, super expensive. As I said, they were like 50 euros. So we bought these individually and I wanted them if it's salt, it's white, and if it's black, uh, it's pepper. And we, just, we found them. They're, they're not a sad, but they're from the same um, family. I don't remember the price, but yes, they're these. And so this is the code if you're interested. Da -da -da. And this is the white one. If you can actually see. Can you manage? Hello. Hello. Okay, so this is the white one. And it's this, the code, if you need it. Da -da -da. Perfect. Then from Ikea but in the atrium uh, no wait it's not, it wasn't the atrium this is like from the mega store we got these so we got these from the mega store so we got this glass soap dispenser and basically mega store ships things from Ikea and it's this this is the code which is lovely I don't know the price of this but trust me nothing was super expensive like for the house we're not going ridiculously expensive on stuff the majority of these items are less than 20 euro so if you're looking for a family, like a budget friendly things for the house I recommend the things that I'm showing you um, and then we bought this which is absolutely stunning uh, it is a let's say juice water um, bottle to have in the fridge especially as we wanted we want the um, reverse osmosis so this would be quite handy and this is let me show you the code because it doesn't have the code over there it's this one i think i think this is the better way to show it to you so that is that and then um ismail wanted this even me because I really liked it. Like I always was impressed with it when I went abroad and stuff, which is just a basic like bottle with the old style, how to open it like from the top and just you refill it with water or whatever you want to drink it. Drink in it. Um, let me show you again. This is the, the code if you need it. Can you actually see? Oh, can you see it? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so that's the code if you need it. And um, then we have as well a mirror, which is this one. And I'm just gonna go oopsie daisy. Like, yeah. So this is the mirror that we got. Can you actually focus? Thank you. So we got this type of mirror. It has a um, magnifi magnifying glass as well on the opposite side, a normal mirror and a magnifying mirror on the other side. It is a brass finish and I'm going to show you the code if you need that. This is the code for the mirror. Can you actually focus please? Let's see. Focus, focus. Alright. It's that. So yes, if you're interested, um, grab that. Then we bought this set of six um, wine glasses. I'm just here Six wine glasses, which are these ones over here. Oh. Which are, I am not a fan of drinking wine, but I love a big glass when I'm drinking wine. And I absolutely love the glasses for the Aperol Spritz. So these are perfect. You get six in the box, which is absolutely great, especially for us that we are planning to have a table of six. So, hey ho. Um, and the name, if you can see, is that. So if you need that, um, just see it on there. Then I think that I got it from Homemade, I think. Um, is my got it, I don't need it. A bottle opener, basically. So it's just a simple bottle opener. Regarding the code, this is it. Can you actually see? Hello. I don't think you can actually see. Okay. So that's the code. We just got that. Then 
I'm just looking at my nails. <laughs> I don't know. Um, and then we went to Talira. And uh, from Talira we bought two items and we bought so a set of six glasses which are just the basic old style. I love old vintage types of style for the water, which are like these. These were each, so I think they were like, I don't know, um, 90 cents each, and I know, I think much less than that. Um, the code, Talira, like, it's useless, They're, they don't have a site, so might as well go there. And then we bought this one over here, which I absolutely love. It is a mixer, like a salad mixer, uh, I don't know, not, uh, I don't know, um, I mean like a cake mixer, bowl, whatever you want to call it. So we bought this one which is yellow, uh, I wanted originally the blue but they were all scratched so we got the yellow, <laughs> how strange we have a yellow basket, <laughs> we have a yellow bowl, um, and this was 3 euro because there is written over here the price so if you can't actually see there is 3 euro over there, so yes, quite a good size for the mixing. Can you actually focus on me now? Okay, great. And basically that's it. Um, so yes, basically we're starting quite seriously now getting like stuff for our house that we don't have. That's the bloody thing that we don't actually have a house. But um, I had a friend of mine which a few years way back she was like looking not looking but you know what i mean like she bought a house and stuff and the first thing she had to do was buy the stupid things that will add up beef, like in a big amount like you know like the salt and pepper shaker the toilet brush and the stuff like that because when then you have a house you will see them as an extra expense that you need to obviously buy so uh, we're buying them prior to actually owning a house which is great but like this we have even for example if by time um, I get fed up with any of these like first of all they were less than 20 euros so it's like fine for me but if for example I see it in place and I don't actually like it um, I would sell it or stuff like they're brand new these things and nothing is second hand in this selection of items to be honest I don't think till now we bought anything second hand. No, no, we didn't buy anything second hand till now. But I have some items in mind which I really want to buy second hand, especially like furniture pieces. Like it, they're ridiculously expensive, like super expensive. Like for example, yesterday, oh not yesterday, today we went to the Apologies because the camera cut me off. Um, and uh, the thing was that all the big pieces that we liked, being mirrors, being furniture, being chairs, being an armchair, being the big pieces, the only brand that actually was catered to our budget with a reason, so to speak, was IKEA. The other ones were like literally over budget, overpriced and everything in between. So actually, and even for the quality of some pieces, I prefer having them second hand being solid wood and stuff like that, instead of buying them like brand new and being the quality being shipped. So this is something exactly um, that we're actually considering as well um, when buying things. These things, for example, a toilet brush, for example, like for hygiene reasons, I wouldn't buy it second hand unless it is absolutely like new new like if for example if this is brand new and I have the set and there is still the label on it and everything like that and I'm guaranteed it's 100% like not used okay I would buy it but two things like stupid things like a uh, coffee table and stuff and uh, mirror and uh, table lamp and stuff like it's, I don't bloody mind like if someone used that or had it I don't care the only thing I think I will be a bit mm, on buying is, for example, my armchair. I absolutely love an armchair and the idea of having someone that I had already sat on it for an amount of years and I, like even the way I sit and stuff, you know, it's not even worth it. So at the end of the day, I would prefer buying a brand new armchair. So it's so always, for example, even a bed, if it's my bloody bed, I would love to have it like 
unless it is not used obviously they bought it like in the wrong color whatever it is wrong size but being the bed that i have in mind if i ever buy a bed for example um uh, it would be brand new for the sake that it is something that you're not going to change every so often why is these ones if one of these breaks or if i see something prettier than these and stuff i would change them it's not a big deal um, they are very budget friendly especially in our age that we're like 23 we don't have a lot of money to splurge on things that are super designer for example if someone came to me and bought me a designer piece I would be very grateful and if I really really like a certain um, piece that I know would put us a bit over budget for the certain item I would still go for it for example there is the smeg kettle and the smeg kettle costs around 175 that to be honest it is for any bloody person would be under un justifying for spending that amount of money on a kettle but being that my dream dream fridge would be a smack and that costs over 2000 euros um for like a birthday present for myself i would go and consider buying a kettle because obviously i drink tea every bloody day so for me it wouldn't even be a waste of money though i wouldn't do the whole collection for example the toaster the, the kettle the mixer and stuff that would be like literally going a bit overboard in my opinion but having like certain pieces here and then being designer i don't find why not um and yes so for now these are the pieces that we actually um collected for our future house that we don't currently have and yes i hope you enjoyed today's video it was a bit all over the place and i'm to be honest i'm a bit run down because i've been doing so many bloody things helping so many people here here there and about but yes um i'm just showing you a bit of snippets here and there of my life i hope you enjoy it and be a bit patient with me and i'll show you a bit of everything but step by step <laughs> because I have so many things to show you, I have so many things to tackle and I have so many things to talk to you about that it requires a, a, a bit of a longer video than just 5 seconds of showing you a snippet of my day so yes, um, I hope you enjoyed today's video and I shall see you in the next one, bye!